so your girl did some damage. She went and she spent some money, honey. I was at work and it was about 11.30. I messaged my boyfriend, I said, babe, can you please take me to Cotton On after work? And he said, for sure, of course. So I got home from work, changed out of my work clothes, went straight to Cotton On and spent $300. Don't know, don't know how. I bought a couple of pairs of sunglasses, some new jeans, tops, a jacket, and some clothes for my BF. I thought it would be cool to just sit down on camera and show you guys what I got from Cotton On. Not a lot of people do like Cotton On clothing hauls and stuff, I guess, because it's just like a basic clothing store. I get majority of my clothes from Cotton On and sometimes they have some banging pieces. They're amazing for like basic staples, but sometimes they can come out with some really cute stuff, which they have. Obviously why I spent $300. Let me just show you what I picked up from Cotton On. Okay? Okay. So they had a sale on when it came to sunglasses. It was two pairs for $20. So I purchased four. One of the pairs though is my boyfriend's. So I got three pairs of sunglasses. Don't ask me why I need three pairs when I've already got about five. I just wanted to get some really cute different styled sunglasses. I want to take some more like funky Instagram pics and stuff. So I got some styles that I usually wouldn't wear. Okay? I'm justifying every purchase even though I know my bank account is screaming at me right now. So this is the first pair I got right here. These are just plain black. I know they look a little bit strange right now, but I was feeling like the 90s vibe. Princess Polly vibes. I'm really into that kind of vibe right now and down to my makeup. I literally want to color my hair. Um, I'm going to get it cut and hopefully colored in the, in the next couple of months. And I want to go like a 90s style. I don't know what it is. I think I'm just going through a mid-20s crisis. I'm turning 20, 25 this year and I just want to revert back to what life was when I was in the womb. As I said, these are just plain black and they're like rectangle, square. And I just think... These are an actual vibe though, honestly, probably not with what I'm wearing right now, but if I was wearing like an all black outfit or like a beige outfit and then had like some dangly necklaces, like dainty gold, wearing these with gold, that's a thumbnail right here, bitch. Anyway, I just think these are an absolute vibe and I can't wait to take some Instagram pics and be all up in the shit with these on, you know what I'm saying? So I take a pic now. I don't know if they'll go with my outfit though. The next pair I got are these ones right here. These ones are different for me too. This is a tortoise shell print. And these are kind of squared off. I don't know. I just kind of really liked these when I put them on. See? Look at them. They're just really, really cool. I just think they're something different for me. They kind of got like a cat eye vibe, but it's like not too cat eye. Because too cat eye on me does not look flattering. And they're also not too large or too small because really tiny sunglasses look horrible on me and then really big ones look horrible on me. But I think these ones are just super cute. I like Instagram photos and just daily fucking wear. You know what I mean? Like this would be a vibe with like anything and everything I feel like. I feel like these ones match like my outfit better, like this top than the black ones do. But I think these ones are my favorite. As soon as I put them on in the store, I was like, Thank you so much, hun. You're coming home with me in my bag right now. The next pair of sunglasses I got are these ones right here. I have owned these before. I just left them in my brother's car. I haven't seen them since. So I just picked up a new pair. I'm not going to take any of these off. These are just like my go-tos. They're not as funky as the other ones. I like the other ones more now that I own those. Um, and kind of, I don't dislike these. I still love these. They still look super cute with certain outfits and stuff like that. But I prefer the other sunglasses that I bought over these ones. Okay, let's talk about tops. So I picked up this top that I'm wearing right now. I'm going to be completely honest. You're going to see some fat rolls right now. I picked up this top here. It's just like a nice crop top. It's got that like square kind of neck vibe that I love. It tapers a little bit in to your cleavage. Then it has like the puffy kind of shoulder vibe thing going on. I love this style right now, honestly. It's just flattering on my body no matter if I've gained weight or lost weight, it just looks good. It has this drawstring as well. So you can kind of push it up and then make it like a full crop top just around your boobs, which I think this is so cute. I just don't have the body for it, 
but I think it's really cute just undone it as well. You can obviously tighten it to whatever length you want. And yeah, I just really like this. That I also got it in white. So I'll try this on and then show you guys on camera. But this is the white one. By the way, I got this in a size medium as well as the white one. I just think these are super cute. I got two pairs of jeans. These ones here are the high rise grazer skinny. I got these in a size 12. These ones are a little big on me. I got them in a really nice and deeper blue because I don't have deep blue jeans. What I will say is the size 12 is a little big around my back, like above my bum. Um, I could definitely get away with wearing a belt. They're also not skin tight on me. And the one thing that I don't like about any pair of jeans, they do the whole bell bottom thing. They like cone out even if they're a skinny jean which is annoying but i usually just fold my jeans um at just at the bottom so it doesn't look like it flares back out again to be honest i probably could have gone a 10 in these jeans but i know what my washing machine's like and i also know what my diet is like so we're sticking with the 12. so i've got these jeans that i'm wearing right now um they're just pretty much the same as the other ones except they're a lighter blue see mum is bloated today Love the color of these ones that I'm wearing right now because they're like a really nice sky blue. They look good with everything. I prefer lighter colored jeans. I used to wear black jeans, only black jeans all the time. Now I never ever want to be seen in a pair of black jeans again. I don't know what it is. I'm just so over black jeans. Can't deal with them anymore. And then the lucky last thing is this jacket, which I absolutely love. So this is the OS denim jacket in the color white asylum um, this was $70 this was expensive but this again is just a denim jacket it is kind of distressed like it's been cut at the bottom I got this in a size large because I wanted it to kind of be oversized just slightly and I also again know what my washing machine is like it shrinks everything that goes into it I just wanted a really nice jacket that I could pair with leggings, um, pants, skirts, anything really, a dress even, even jeans that was a different color and wasn't the typical blue. I wanted something a little bit edgy, something different. I also pictured this being really cute with like this top that I bought as well. I think that would look so nice laid with some nice gold jewelry. You could wear this like off the shoulder and everything. I just think it's so cute. Such a vibe. I also got this because I just thought it was really cute. And this was not on the shelves or anything. But I got this to take away. Like you know how when you buy a cotton on you can do like the $5 donation, buy a bag or whatever. I picked this one because I thought it was really cute. And I'm really into finding cute little like, you know tote bags or whatever you want to call them um, for doing my food shopping and stuff in. I love line drawings. I love them so much. I just, especially of people, I think they're so beautiful, so simple. Minimalistic, but stunning. I love them so much. Sorry, just itching my nose. If I had the bulls, I would get a, like a line drawing as a tattoo, but um, I'm uninked because I'm petrified. And I'm such an indecisive person that I don't want to go and get something done on my body and then regret it three weeks later. Even though I got my nose pierced and I did that when I was 14 and it, it's nearly 11 years later and I still like my nose ring. So that is it for today's video. I know it was short and sweet, something simple. I hope you guys really did enjoy it. If you did, you know what to do. Hit the thumbs up button, comment down below. Don't leave without subscribing. I say it every single time because 70% of you guys that watch my videos aren't even subscribed and that's just plain fucking rude. I need to go down the street and get myself some dinner. Um, and then I'm going to probably hop in bed and edit this and watch more YouTube on a Saturday night at home alone my favorite type of night that's it for me i'll leave my most recent videos here on the screen right now so if you're in the mood to watch me you can just click and do so i make it easy for you honey you don't have to think about it you can just click and give me some views give me some coin so i can come back and keep shopping for you all i hope you guys are having a wonderful day wherever you are and i'll see you in my next video bye oh whoa i did like what was that that was um un, un mm.